hello guys in this video i will show you how to validate password which ex exist which is stored in the sql server database table and how to compare password between two text box whether it's match or not in c sharp windows form application just see this video continue Add new item in the solution. Uh, item name is password validation form. Okay, just click on add. Form is added. Start position center screen to design ID back. It will display in the center screen. That's so, okay. Back color change the back color to display look creative. Okay. I just change back color now I'm designing the form with four text box and a button control and level control to display validation masses size 55 uh, 15 this is header okay uh, the header is password validation form yes You can design as your choice. Username. Oh, this color not match in the, the background. Yes, now it's uh, looking perfect. The font is uh, 12. Okay. Username and this is. I, I'm just uh, taking four uh, four level control for four text box. Uh, first text box text size is 10 okay my design is approximately done text box 1 2 3 and 4 the first text box is username and second text box is password uh, current password what is already available in the database and uh, third is new password then fourth is confirm password I'm just taking a Button control from drag uh, by dragging and dropping from the toolbox. Okay, uh, this is just I'm um, just writing the text is the uh, button text is change password. Okay, I just uh, click when this is my database, my past SDB, and this is login tab. Here are two user uh, user exit sweep and uh, password so one two three four. Okay. Now this is the link queue file. I'm just dragging drop to connect link uh, database with SQL Server. There are many tutorial uh, in this channel. Uh, exist uh, how to connect with uh, database in your application with uh, uh, link queue. Just to see this video if you want. Okay. Uh, this is key fresh. I am just writing the code in the key fresh text box key fresh event to check the password in the whether it is exist in the database or not according to the username what you put in the username text box bicycle from as in db dot login tab so use as dot username equal to text box one text box so what username what username you put in the text box one uh, the, it will check the password of that usernames okay now add uh, two display the masses i'm adding uh, another level control text is dot dot okay without text i will get text from the code after execution lbl msg okay now if the password is match with you with the database then uh, lbl msg dot text uh, the message will show as okay okay if not matched i mean the, if username uh, what you put if password not match then lbl msg dot text equal to invalid and the color of the Label control will be red if not match. If match, then the color will be green. In that case, just write system dot drawing dot color. You can use namespace. Then you you can only use color dot green. Okay. Now just copy paste color dot red. If not match, the it will show the label control color red as masses. Username swift as w i f t. This is my username and password password is s one two three it's now it's still invalid four yes 
if the password is matched with the database then it will show ok else invalid ok now uh, I am writing the code in the button click event to change the password to change password first of all I uh, just copy paste, uh, copy paste because this is equal operation here you can see textbox 3 equal textbox 4 it means new password and confirm password must match if the new password and confirm password match then it will show execute then it will change if not then it will show the message is invalid uh, here I am adding another uh, level control to display the message whether the new password and confirm password match or not and the level control is lbl msg1 first message is msg lbl msg and second one is lbl msg1 yes lbl msg oh sorry if the tag was three dot text and text for new password and confirm password is match then it will uh, change password i wrongly put it there if not match then it will show the invalid masses ml msg1 okay not matched sorry not invalid uh, this is not matched it will show the masses not matched with new password and confirm password um, uh, if matched then it will change the password st dot password equal to text box 4 dot text new password confirm password db dot submit change you must put it to save in the database and it will show the masses after successfully sub, uh, changed uh, message show as successfully changed password okay now another uh, whether it's match or not in Kia when you write you can understand whether it's match or not in that case in the text box 4 key of uh, just uh, just add this code if text box 3 dot uh, text box 3 equal to text box 4 then uh, the ma message show in that case just uh, copy paste this code if match then it will show the masses uh, with the color green just show the message matched it's if not matched then it will show the message not matched okay this is the text box for key, key of event and text box 2 key of event uh, username is swift and password is so one two three four now see username swift password Initially, I just put S invalid invalid. Yes, S1234. Then it's okay. Database password is S1234 and confirm password S at the rate 12. New password, confirm password not match, not match, not matched, not matched. But yes, now it's matched. Just click on change password, change password. But uh, password is pa in the text box is not in a password mode. Uh, that's uh, just for sure I am just showing you uh, yes password changed in the database the uh, change system password card to true then it will not show the password as text it will show the dot 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 uh, okay use system password card true yes now start debugging yes just put username swift password s at the rate one two then it will be okay yes okay then new password if new password it matches confirm password then it will match okay i think you understand well just system change password uh, successfully changed password How to compare password between two text box with compare validator and 
code in C sharp 